And here we are in the classic audio room with John Wolf. Good morning, John. How are you? Good morning, Peter. And you have a number of exhibitors here. Who's all participating in the room this year? Uh, along with uh, Classic Audio is uh, Atmosphere Music Systems, uh, which is a preamp and amplifier uh, manufacturer, mm -hmm. and uh, Purist Audio uh, uh, Cables. Out of Texas? Out of Texas. And uh, along with them is Staltec, uh, which they are digital. We've got their music uh, uh, D DAC and uh, running off of a... Uh, music server and uh, <clears throat> they make a, a, a transport also mm -hmm. but uh, we're running it off of the uh, a computer. Just a computer yep. into the and DAC today. Very, very, very nice sound. Get over close to the speaker. I don't know if people know just the size and the scope. This is the T3.4 version. And this has a field coil. This has a field coil front woofer and mm -hmm. a field coil compression driver behind this uh, mm -hmm. all wood horn. Mm -hmm. And now in comparison, the T1 would be how much taller? The T1 is uh, maybe an inch and a half taller, but it's six inches wider. That's the big difference. The right, width. and yeah. it uses that larger horn that's sitting on the table over there. Uh, that's a full 24 inch wide horn, and this one is uh, 17 inches wide. Yeah, you can see the difference here. That's the T3 horn, and then over to the T1 horn here. It's much, much bigger. And here are the drive units. Yes, this is the this is the drive unit that mounts on the back of either wood horn, mm -hmm. uh, and this is the uh, woofer that's in the front here. And in both the T1 and the T3 systems, there's another 15-inch woofer aimed at the floor but that's a, a permanent Alnico magnet. Mm -hmm. And each system also uses the Fostex T500 Super Tweeter. And here we go, we can get a close look at that. These are very, very impressive speakers. They're beautiful looking. What are the MSRP at? Uh, 44,950. Mm -hmm. For the pair. For the pair and your choice of woods. Very good. Well, we have the atmosphere amps in between. Correct. It's uh, the reissued uh, Novacron amplifier, which uses a 6C33C-B uh, triode tube. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, these amplifiers were produced in the 90s. And uh, due to popular demand, uh, he's uh, decided uh, to reissue those in the first uh, version of the reissue uh, was just prior to Rocky Mountain. I think we have a little bit of them at uh, Rocky Mountain. Ralph mm -hmm. talks a little bit about them and we'll mm -hmm. show you everybody the rest of the room. Uh, the records are nicely stacked. It's like your own personal living room on wheels. When you come to a show and you're an exhibitor, you bring everything with you. The hotel rooms are barren and you come in and you set up. And so, I think I forgot to mention that uh, triplanar uh, tone arm is also a participant in this room and this is uh, his table uh, with a brand new 12 inch arm which is uh, being introduced at this show. Uh, look at that, that's a, that's a great looking arm. We have a sample of the arm that we have under review on two turntable systems. We've had it on a, a one Dolph turntable and we currently have it on the Triangle Arc signature. And here we have the music, the atmosphere MP1 for atmosphere. And the power supply is below. And here we have the stall tech deck over here. Correct. And that rounds out our room. Let's do some listening. Right. Thank you very much, Mr. Wolf.